Hi guys, welcome to all and in this today's video, we are going to see another important concept called np.dev which is very very small concept but is a very important one. So let me first uh, import the numpy package by using import keyword. Yeah, before introducing you the coding concept, let me tell you what is the general format of uh, np.dev. So it consists of mainly like condition, the array present right now with us and the replacement. The condition we want to check if it is true and we want to uh, not replace the value and we have to put as it is and if the condition fails we want to replace at that time so yeah so with this let's go and create uh, one numpy array consisting of element 0 to 9 and by, by using np.array let me create numpy array let's print this guys yeah so you can see that uh, printed here yeah now the task I want to do is replace all odd numbers with minus one. So how can I do that? So this can be done by using the condition, right? So if a percentage by two equal to equal to zero, that means you know that, right? When even number divided by two, it will leads to the remainder zero. So if the condition is met, do not replace the element. Uh, leave it as it is, okay? If the condition fails, then at that time you want to replace that number with minus one. So let's print and check what is the values present right now. Yeah, you can see right, one is got replaced with minus one, three got replaced with minus one, and all odd numbers got replaced with minus one. So all even numbers all live as it is. Okay. Now in the toss two, we will see another important concept. Okay. So I um, created the numpy array consisting of minus one, seven, all these numbers. Like means consisting mixture of like positive and negative numbers. Now I want to replace all numbers that are less than zero with forty-five. So I can do this by using np.wave condition and this. Let me execute this guys. Yeah, sorry, I want to execute this one first. Okay. Yeah, you can see right minus one got replaced with 45, minus two got replaced with 45. Yeah. So all the there are no negative numbers now present right now. So if b is greater than zero, I want to not do any replacements. And if it is less than zero, that means condition is fails and false and i want to replace at that time okay you got clarity right now right so an additional tip please refer the official documentation of np.wave to get much clarity about the concept and different parameters present in it thanks for watching guys